Hi, uh, welcome back to my channel, and this is going to be the second to last episode of the October Spooky series. For me, currently, Halloween is tomorrow, it's Tuesday, and uh, I wanted to make soaps for you. <laughs> I didn't have time to do all the things I wanted to do, all the video plans I had, but um, I wanted to squeeze one more in, which is making spooky soaps. Uh, if you didn't know, I'm working on opening a shop on Etsy selling soaps and candles and bath bombs and things like this. So I've been like practicing and experimenting with soap mostly and I've made a few candles. But soap's like my specialty right now. <laughs> I found these really cute molds at Walmart. They're like ice cubes for like Halloween parties but I'm gonna use them for soap because they're silicone molds. If you saw my first Halloween video, they were there. And today I'm just gonna make one of them because I'm on a time crunch right now, but uh, I'm gonna be making some skulls, so keep watching. <laughs> so I'm currently in our extra room. It's an unfinished room that we have down here in the basement. And uh, me and Anthony kinda set it up into like a little workshop. I have my uh, microwave there and uh, bowls and scoopy things and scissors and alcohol and bowl. Did I say bowls? But yeah, so and I don't really have like a place to put my camera in here because it's just windows and no like counters or anything like that. Um, and, but we're gonna get more tables. I only have one right now. But yeah, we're gonna slowly set this place up to my little, like my little workshop, so that's exciting. Sorry if you hear noises and bumps upstairs as people walking around and stuff like that. So just wanted to insert a warning, I guess. I'm sorry if the lighting's really bad because of this. Yeah, and the light in here is pretty garbage too, so. I'm gonna try my best though. Hi, okay, so I'm gonna record like this angle here. So, sorry if you can't see my face. So this is the mold that I'm gonna be using for uh, spools. There's the inside. And yeah, I'm gonna be just using the uh, the base color soap that I have, which is white. So, because schools are white, yeah. So, what I do, I have these bowls here. They were housewarming gifts. <laughs> I don't have a kitchen to eat and use them, so. Use them for my craft. So, I have the soap here. And I don't really know how many I'm gonna make. So, I'm just gonna like wing it with how many cubes I use of it. So I'm probably gonna use like four of them because they're like in little cubes. So yeah, I'm just gonna cut that up real quick and I'll be back. All right, now that I have my soap here uh, and my molds right here, and I'm gonna use whisk to um, mix in the scent that I'm gonna put in so that it really is thorough. And then I'm gonna use this to stir it while it's in the melting process and whatnot. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna get the scent right now. Right now, I only have t two scents. I have a uh, vanilla and lavender, and these are the only two I have, but I'm gonna get more in the future, definitely. But so I don't really know what to make these schools smell like, so I'm just gonna make them smell like vanilla because it smells really good. <laughs> to start melting it, I'm gonna put it in for 20 seconds. And then after that's done, I'm going to keep uh, putting it in for five second intervals and mixing it every time. So, yeah. Oh, shit. Okay. This is after uh, 20 seconds. It's not very melted but the bottom is and it's starting to like slip around and stuff so i'm just going to give it like a quick little move around and then put it back in for five second intervals now that it's melted i have to be quick here because it starts to harden really fast um, i might even put it in for another five seconds after this so right now I'm going to put in a couple drops of vanilla just so that it 
They smell good. Have to have the whisk here. It's already getting getting a little hard, so I'm gonna have to put it back in. Well mixed in. Uh, is it? I think we can. No, I'm gonna put it in for five more seconds and then pour. I'm gonna spray this with alcohol, just so that it. Come on. This is like the first time I'm working on this tiny table that wobbles in this room and I uh, kind of fucked up when I was pouring and I probably should be wearing a better shirt. This has like a, a, a thing, see that, that can hook <laughs> and I didn't realize it and when I was pulling the hot soap, hot soap out of the microwave, this little thing caught on the door and it jerked the bowl and I got soap, hot soap all over my hand. Not burned, thankfully. Got everywhere, got all over the table and the floor and I uh, super messy pour just because I was in pain because it was burning my hand and like I was rushing to finish. So I mean, I didn't get the full like um, tray cause there's, um, there's 10 little skulls in this specific mold and I only got like seven ish and then like a really shitty eighth one that doesn't even count um, and it was really messy and spilled everywhere I wasted so much soap but you know I just <laughs> I got to start in here so I just got to get used to it I guess and this is the first time I'm doing it here so I'm not too mad at myself um, but yeah, I can show you what they look like while they're drying right now. But yeah, here it is. <laughs> I got a lot around the sides. I even got it on the floor. I've been trying to clean it up, but I mean, I don't know. I got, I got it on, on the microwave and it dripped down a little bit and this whole area was soap, but I cleaned that up and I cleaned my stuff. They're drying down there, but yeah, that's them. There's a lot of bubbles on that one because I poured it like in that one because I poured it like badly but you know that one looks really good <laughs> really hope they turn out well because I don't know I just I hate failing especially with something I like to do like crafts but yeah so that was my video for uh, the day before Halloween and tomorrow is the grand finale uh, it's not too big of a video but it's still a video, so yeah. <laughs> so it's the next morning, and uh, I f think I forgot to show the soaps yesterday. So uh, this is how they all basically look. They came out good, thankfully. Um, this one is one of the best ones. Uh, the camera just doesn't want to focus on it for some reason. But, oh, there's a little better. You can see it has like the teeth and the indents for the nose and eyes and whatnot, but yeah, so <coughs> I just wanted to show the soaps a bit after they were done. <coughs> the rest of them are in here. I gave one to Ariel, and then there was also one that was like really, really crappy that was like just the face part, like no back or anything <coughs> that I just put in our bathroom is like a test thing. Some of them came out like uh, thicker than others, um, but they're they're cool. It's good, the mold is nice. So yeah, those are the soaps. <laughs> I wanna sit and do like a formal goodbye and stuff like that for this video. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Kind of an all over the place, like quick doozy of a video. Um, 
next year I promise I'll be more organized. Maybe I'll do some of the ideas that I've had for like fall because November is still fall, right? At least in Georgia it is. And so maybe I'll do some of the videos that I missed out on for October and November. So I'll have more time to plan that. <laughs> Subscribe if you're not. Check out the other videos in this spooky October series. There's like, there's like, there's a lot of them. If you count the half videos, there's a good bit. I'm proud of myself. This is the most consistent with uploading I've ever been in the entirety of my channel. And I hope to keep it going because I'm like getting in the groove now. Thanks for watching.